Hello everybody and welcome back to a new episode. In this one we are looking at CTRM stock. Now this is a 40 cent stock which is looking at some big returns over the past month. If we get a percentage on it we can see over the past month we're up 166% and of course that is a very significant amount. Over the past few days we are starting to see this one slow down and actually sell off a little bit which does kind of ask the question is this one a good buy right now and of course should you buy it at the current price and are we going to see this one go a bit higher in the future? Well of course I am not a financial advisor but what I can do is give you all of my opinions based on what you have been seeing and of course that is the intention of tonight's episode. If it sounds like a plan guys please do leave a like and subscribe it would be appreciated and of course if you want to become a member you can do that by pressing the join button. Also feel free to head over to the discord but with all that being said don't click on any dodgy links in the comment section and I am going to jump straight into the video. So we are going to start this one off by looking at what the company does. So Castor Maritime is a company which basically works in the o in the ocean segment and of course the transportation of bulk cargoes worldwide. It provides uh, seaborne transportation services for dry bulk cargo including iron ore, coal, grains, steel products, fertilizers, cement and all that kind of good stuff. You can see basically it carries large items and of course that is a very profitable industry potentially if you can play your cards right now of course looking at this company and of course the share price it does look like this company is kind of low in its industry right now not necessarily a bad thing but because that does definitely present some room um, for expansion in the future and look at the actual share price based on the price action that we have been seeing you know we have seen this um, similarly before when we've seen a big increase and then a little bit of a sell-off in the shares price now Personally, in my opinion, I wouldn't be too surprised if we were to sit quite flat at the current point, which we are at right now, for a few days. And I wouldn't think that was a bad thing at all, because of course, looking at this one in context, guys, we have gone up by so much, it wouldn't be too much of a shock if we were to sit pretty flat for some time now. Now, realistically, you know, over the longer period of time, yes, there is potential here. And when I say that, I mean over the next two to three weeks, I think we can definitely see some big growth on this one, as it could definitely hit past the uh, 60 cent range, in my personal opinion. Now, of course, looking at this company, obviously not a bad industry that they are in. Um, it's probably going to be more of a long-term grower, even though we are up quite significantly right now. It definitely does have some potential to make it past a one to um, $3 range, definitely potentially in the future. And there is a message from our Discord, so of course, feel free to join that one. But yeah, basically, guys, what I'm, t what I'm saying with this stock is, you know, we are going to be seeing some potential for this one long-term. But when it comes to the company short-term, yes, we are seeing some more potential for some big growth, hopefully in the future. But when it comes to, you know, big growth, penny socks this one does have a lot of room to grow definitely in my opinion but i would definitely say there are potentially uh, you know more stable higher growth penny stocks in this industry but overall it definitely depends on what factor of risk you are willing to take with this one in my opinion based on what we have been seeing it is a little bit less volatile it's less likely to crash instantly i think that's a good thing as it does kind of indicate a more stable investment but you know the question is how much of a gain are we going to be seeing in the future subsequently i do think we'll still a big increase but i'm not sure if it will be the biggest in all of the penny stocks which we have been seeing on the channel not necessarily a bad thing if you don't mind a smaller increase and um, for that trade-off with a little bit of stability but please do make sure to do your own research overall though with this stock i would definitely not hesitate to buy a few shares it's not the best penny stock in my personal opinion because you know there are definitely more potentially volatile but also potentially more uh, high growth stocks for the long-term future but looking at this company it's in an established market sector and of course if they can keep growing the company and growing the revenues we are seeing some big potential for this one long term either way uh, so i hope you enjoyed the video guys if you did please do leave a like and subscribe and i'll see you in the next one goodbye until then